Welcome guys. This is a behind the scenes of our first collaboration with Anuel. We're doing a switch, Air Jordan 1 switch with a little twist, an off-white twist. All right, before we get started, you already know how we do this with energy, sugar-free energy. All right, so I cut all the pieces and now I'm marking them all. And we kind of had to do a little uh, modification to the original pattern. If you guys uh, go on my website and see the switch pattern, this one's a little modified because we had to do the off-white version. So it's gonna have this off-white stuff. All right, so let's finish tracing all the pieces and then we're gonna start gluing, attaching them and sewing little behind the scenes I thought you guys would enjoy I know you guys are all bored at home doing nothing or working if you can work and watch YouTube are you really working okay we got that piece done with this piece I had already marked it but we on the backing the thermal backing so when you heat it up all the all the uh, lines were erased with the heat so we're just gonna mark it again another little tip for you guys when you guys are marking this don't mark the side with the triangle mark the other side here on these here I just marked the, the whole rectangle because this pen is super thin and why not but on these, just mark the top side without the little notch on it. So, just like that. And the other one, we're looking for it. I'm sure my intern's gonna find it any minute now. But, all right, let's mark these two. These are, uh, I actually printed this directly on to the heel counter material. If you guys have seen the off-whites up close, the back heel is actually, the heel counter is exposed. So I thought I would paint these and uh, put his logo on there. It's the first time doing this, we're gonna try it out. If it doesn't work, we'll just do a regular red leather. I have some of this left over with his logo printed on. But I wanna try this first because it's fucking dope. I've never seen anybody do the actual off-white with the exposed heel counter material. Maybe it's for a reason. Maybe it's not going to work, but it's worth a try. So this is another modified pattern piece for the off-white heel. You don't have to push hard on these pens. Don't push down super hard. You just got to kind of glide them through. And it's not like, uh, it's not going to come out more if you push hard and scribble it and scratch it. Anyways, this is done. This is done. All our pieces are done. We just need the other ramp, which we'll find in a minute. And we're going to start gluing now. So this is the first part I'm going to stitch. It's going to be this. Do this and this to this. So this is a finished leather. I'm just going to scratch it up a little bit just so that the glue adheres a little better. All right, man. Where are my tools? At? Have your tools ready, guys. Preparing to fail is, failing, no, failing to prepare is whatever, man. Have your tools ready. This is just a craft tool from Tandy Leather. You can get them anywhere. It's pretty much like a file. I just use it to rough up the edges so the glue, the contact cement sticks a little better on this finished material. I already did all the cutting and skiving off camera. 
So just rough it up a little, just like that. And this one too. You can get a sandpaper, do this with pretty much anything. And you really don't have to do this. This is just a temporary kind of, we're gonna glue it on just so we can stitch it on so it's not a huge deal, but I am a professional, so I'm gonna act like a professional. You do things right. I'm also gonna scratch this surface because I'm using the back side, the suede side of this material because I didn't have any gray suede, but I like the way this one looked for the off-white. So I'm just going to scratch, scratch up the back side of this. Actually, let me move all these pieces so we don't get them dirty. No luck. You have to cut another one. Yeah, go. Um, I don't know. Since what is the piel blanca que usamos para que corte otro? Let him let him cut. No, let let uh, tu corta lo. Ese es izquierdo. Necesito uno derecho. Pie derecho. Zeke doesn't know how to cut yet. I'm just kidding. He cuts them real fast. I'm pretty sure my pattern maker at home was born with an exacto knife. When he was born, he had a little baby exacto knife. He's been cutting patterns ever since. That way? Yeah, see? <laughs> so I'm just gonna put a little bit of content. This is just regular all-purpose um, barge, barge all-purpose cement, contact cement. Just gonna put a little bit here. All you need is a light coat. First we do both sides, make sure we get a good adhesion. Try to let these dry for about you know, just a couple minutes, five minutes. I mean, whatever. If you let it dry longer and it completely dries on you, just reheat it. It'll reactivate it. Or you can just put a lot of pressure on it and it'll be okay. Like I said, we're just going to hold these together just till we stitch them. And uh, I like uh, taking my time and gluing them. Just adds another layer of reinforcement there for the stitches and you're not in danger of them moving all over the place when you're stitching. Sometimes the doubles, instead of, uh, instead of contact cement, a lot of times I'll just use double-sided tape, which is also fine, but I'm gonna take my time with these. These are for VIP. So, let's let this dry for a little, and then we start planning our next step. What's our next step? I don't, we need the heel tabs. Okay, so. As with all my patterns, we're gonna try and cover up the red lines, all right? So we try and just 
or cover up the, the registration marks that you have on your pattern. They are not meant to be put under the line or over the line. They're meant to just, well, I guess, over the line, just barely covered up. Kind of like, like so. All right. And then I'm just going to hammer them down a little. The gimbal moving. That thing's good. So all my patterns, all the patterns I sell, once you learn how to use them, you can modify them and do whatever you want. But learn how to play the game first before you start changing all the rules. There it is. Our lateral quarter panels ready to be sewn, stitched. All right, so let's get the next piece ready, which is going to be. You want to pause there? Sure. Because I need a. No tenemos los heel tabs, güey. Los cuadritos, los heel tabs. De este rojo, ponle que se vea poquito algo de lo negro, ¿no? Ese sin backing, nomás. <laughs> 